Hey, what's going on today, guys? My name is that Volkswagen guy, and today I am going to be explaining the top five things I hate about my 2010 Subaru Impreza. Alrighty, so uh, I don't know how I should make this list. Should I go five to one or one to five? Anyways, the first thing that I hate about the Subaru Impreza. The amount of plastics everything in this car is plastic and it's it's okay i guess it, it does the job i know it's not no luxury car but there's just a lot of plastic like a lot of plastic until you actually get into one of these like plastic everywhere doors plastic 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 like it's all plastic and honestly I could care less about it. All right, so the second thing that I hate about my Subaru Impreza is actually the stock radio. All right, so the speakers are fine. When I connect it through aux cord, like for my Spotify, speakers are great, but the actual head unit itself, whenever I just want to listen to the radio, it sucks. Like, um, like for, this car goes up to 40, like for the volume. So every time when I, listen to my Spotify, I usually have it around 30, 32, 34. But when I'm listening to the radio, I have to have it at least like 36 or 38 just in order to hear anything. So yeah, that's one reason why I hate this Impreza. All right, so the third thing that I hate about this Impreza, now I will get a video of it in a little bit. I just, I'm just waiting for my car to warm up here at work. But the car has a loud howl. Now I can't figure out if it's either the wheel bearing or the transmission. Now this is only for this car, like just so you guys know, it's not all Impreza's, but there's a loud howl. Now I'm thinking it might be the wheel bearing, but I'm also reading like on Reddit and like Subaru forums and all that saying that the five speed manuals that tend to howl when they're, when the bearings are starting to go out. I don't know. But it gets annoying, especially when you're on the highway cruising and next that's all you hear is a loud howl and then you got to use music to drone it out. Oh, it, it, it gets me every time. I hate it. I absolutely hate it. Like, I don't know if you guys can hear that, but. All right, so number four, once again, is for this car only. The synchros for reverse are actually going. So every now and then, whenever when I pop it into reverse, it takes a few tries to get in. Like sometimes I have to go in the first or in the fifth even, and then shoot it right back into reverse. Now obviously I, I have my I'm on a stop and I'm not doing it at full speed, obviously. But even then it does not want to go in the reverse sometimes. And honestly, it's kind of annoying, especially when I'm trying to leave my house to go to work or leaving work to go home or to my girlfriend's or to go grocery shopping even. It's annoying. And the last thing, number five, that I hate about this car is the dampening. Now, you do hear a lot of road noise in this car. A lot of it. And especially and because the car is a lot of plastic inside, you also hear a lot of creaks and cracks everywhere too. Like I go down a bumpy road, that's all I'm hearing. Tires, that's all I'm hearing. Like you do hear a lot of road noise in this car. Like, don't get me wrong. It's a great car, all wheel drive, manual, but yeah. It's just, there's got at least a little bit of sound dampening. Like you hear everything, like the wind. And that's all you can hear. Like, oh, but yeah. Those are my f five reasons why I hate my Subaru Impreza. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed the video, leave a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.